In this video, I'm going to show you how to create a custom field for notes in Outlook 2013 or 2010. Right click on the header row above the message list. This is where you change the sort order. Choose View Settings and then click on the Columns button. Click New Column and type a name for your column. When you create a new column, you can choose from different types of columns to create. We need a text column. Depending on the type of column you create, you may have different formats to choose from. We can only choose text. Click OK. Click OK. Now you want to click the Other Settings button. Click on the option to allow in-cell editing. Click OK. Now you can return to Outlook. You'll need to move the reading pane to be able to take notes or you can go to the view tab click on reading pane and turn it off. When I have a message conversation I can add a note to one message in the conversation. To be able to add notes to all messages you want to disable the option to show as conversations. Now you can type a note for any message. 